15 year old boy remains in life threatening condition after he and two other youths attempted to ride on top of a moving train in Toronto on Saturday night. We are asking um, local residents, businesses, um, any drivers with dash cam or surveillance uh, video to, um, if they do have any of the incident or they were in the area, to please call police. And CTV's Tony Grace has been following this for us. It's a horrific story, Tony. Give us uh, some of the details to it. It certainly is, Roger. Look, this all happened in the middle of the night, late Saturday night. It was around midnight, actually. There was a train, a GO train, leaving Toronto's Union Station, heading east along a very busy Lake Ontario waterfront train line. Three teens at some point during that ride, aged 14 to 16, somehow got out of the coach of the train, climbed onto the roof. One of them was seriously injured on the roof of that train. Play safe! Play safe! Before it's too late! Stop heading for danger! Wait! Better play safe! Beware! Take care! And always prepare!
Now, uh, ambulances, police um, converging, uh, rushing to the very next train station when that train was, was stopped and when everyone figured out what had happened, the teen was rushed to hospital where he is fighting for his life right now. What police are looking into is a couple of things, Roger. What were the specifics surrounding how that teen was injured on top of the train? They're undoubtedly looking into how the teens got on top of the train in the first place as well from inside the coach. And then also, what led them to do this? Why did they do this? Police pointing yesterday to the fact that there are all kinds of videos out there on social media now showing showing stunts, like, like what we're seeing here, where people are getting on top of trains. Uh, some people are even calling it train surfing and, and filming videos and sharing them. And in some cases, being spotted. This, this was filmed from, from an expressway from someone in the vehicle. And then this scene here is last year in Toronto when a teen um, was killed after getting on top of a moving subway train. So this is out there. It's, it seems to be happening, and we seem to be hearing about it um, with, with a regular, in, in sort of regular intervals, very, very disturbing incidents. But social media, uh, police say, very well may have played a role in what prompted these teens to get on top of this train in Toronto as it was moving Saturday night, leaving one of them, uh, as I mentioned, Roger, fighting for his life in hospital right now as police try to sort through these difficult questions at a very sensitive time. Yeah, and these dangerous stunts that people are doing for social media and the likes that come with it, uh, there's a concern about this, isn't there? Yes, because now... And by the way, in, in the case of this teen who was critically injured Saturday night, Roger, there are reports that as he was on top of the train, he hit something, he came into contact with something mm -hmm. and fell. We're working to confirm the exact specifics with Toronto Police right now uh, about the details of that injury. Oh, oh. tragic story all around as, as, a, as a family, you know, hopes for a positive outcome here, Roger. Absolutely devastating. CGV's Tony Grace, thank you for that. You bet.